My name is Jim Duffy. I'm the uh, Secretary of Technology for the Commonwealth of Virginia. What Virginia is doing is uh, economic development. Data centers is a big part of economic development. And in the Commonwealth, economic development is a team sport. So it's not just the state government. You have the county government and the city government. And in some cases, in the southern part of Virginia, you have commissions set up with funding to actually invest in companies that want to invest in their particular geography. So it's a combination of efforts that uh, result in incentivizing business coming to Virginia. Um, in the case of data centers, it's beautiful in the sense that data centers are geographically neutral. They can provide services and horsepower to customers all over the country, no matter where they're from. They could be in Singapore, Mexico, California, or Southern Virginia. We have several programs designed to attract investment. Uh, each program has uh, its own windows and scales and uh, uh, bars that you have to meet in order to, uh, in order to qualify. So I would encourage anyone uh, looking at the data center industry um, possibility in the, in the Commonwealth to take a look at all of the economic development incentives. I think basically the most attractive one and the most competitive one that we have is uh, the exemption of sales and use tax in data centers that are built over a certain, with a certain amount of money of investment and a certain number of employees. If there's anything that increases exponentially, it's uh, data. Everyone's producing data, not just businesses. Every person's producing data. They're producing data on, on their phones, they're producing data on their laptop, on their desktop, the business is on their mainframe, and no one throws data away, and that has to be stored somewhere. And uh, the people that have uh, focused on this niche are in the same kind of business as, uh, as cemeteries. You know the data is going to be there. You know you're going to have a job. You know it's always going to be there. It's not going to stop, at least from my perspective. So I think uh, from a data center point of view, the future is quite bright. You know, Raging Wire uh, is one of those companies that has, uh, has the vision and has seen the niche, has seen the demand, has seen the uh, constant growth rate, has seen the opportunity. And it's come here to uh, Ashburn, which I mentioned is a, is a big crossroads of the internet here in the U.S. And we're very proud that they've selected Virginia to invest in. And we're very proud to be able to have them as part of our new uh, business community. Um, I think if you look at the Raging Wire's business model, it's, it's really quite nice. It's very, very straightforward. Uh, essentially, they, they guarantee their customers state-of-the-art security, and 100% uptime. Essentially, that says to the customer, give me your data, I'll take care of it better than anyone else, and you can access it anytime you want, 724, 365 days a year. I think that's a great business model. It's not complex, it's straightforward, and people can understand it. And I think they'll have a lot of success here, and I want to congratulate them and thank them very much for coming to Ashburn and thank them for their business and thank them for their investment in the Commonwealth.